Well, this is Justin, and we're at uh, Lums Barbecue, which I'm going to give you a little panorama here of Lums. Just one big, there's Joan there, she's freezing to death. We don't have any heat in the car, so we're just walking around like uh, like two dummies. Stopping for coffee every hour. Anyway, see, we've got a little piece of Lums here, and I'll show you the barbecue. We had so you get an idea what you're dealing with here is just a big old place with lots of barbecue and whatever else you you may need. And I'll just show you what the barbecue looks like now. I'm gonna pan down on it if I can. There's Joan again. And then we're gonna nobody quite understands the needs of the cameraman, except the cameraman. This is the barbecue before Joan started to eat it up, you know. So you're looking at a a pretty good chunk of barbecue. Hold it up here for the camera. See what I mean? It's ribs, brisket. But your sausage, they like that. Here's smoked sausage. It's a pretty good barbecue. All right? And just to give you an idea, I'm going to lift up the pork rib. You see there's more. There's the potato salad underneath, you know, and this brisket here. Right? All right. Take another look at it here. Get it back here a little bit so you... All right, so we're trying to dig into this, waiting for the coffee to get ready so we can warm up. Anyway, this is uh, uh, at exit 456 on Route 10, going through Texas, a town called Junction. You have to, when you get off Route 56, if you're coming towards El Paso, uh, you want to head towards the town of Junction itself. It's about a mile from the, from the exit. It's not with the regular fast food stuff. It's on the right as you come up. Um, that road, you know, the, that you get off or whatever. It's, it's the only road, so you, so you really can't go along. There's a little sign pointing towards Junction. Get there. A half a mile to a mile up, you see a little place. Loves barbecue, and that's where you should go. You have barbecue, so. You now, Joan has something to say about it, too. She wants to be famous. She wants to be more famous than she is. But she's not, you can see she looks like a... Like a lumberjack. It looks like a lumberjack. She's like hippie lumberjack. <laughs> she has some things to say. And I want to get back to eating here. Hey, you just want my mouth to be busy talking <laughs> so you can be. <laughs> but, well, she has a lot to say. I just can't think of anything right now. As I'm, usual. My mind is on food. <laughs> Warm food. But her general complaint is there's no movies of me, but every time I turn the lens on her, she has nothing to say right now. <laughs> so she's going to be the star of silent films. <laughs> now, and you, you hear her laughing in the background. That's about it. You see the wool cap she has on and the two layers of sweaters and a Actually, jacket. Uh, a jacket, um, a sweater borrowed from the other Joan, a shirt under that. And of course, I'm aware. I'm going to swing the. This is a rib. This is a pork rib. You can't get one of these in Florida. You know what I mean? They got those little dinky ribs. These guys know ribs. This is a big rib. You put it right up close to. You can see there's layers on it. See that? See that? Those are layers of different meat, you know? It's like, this is the age of the dinosaurs, and this is when the first amphibians came up, and then humans are on top. <laughs> so, anyway, they serve their stuff a little. It's not as, as much of the sauce on it down south, you know? So, just so you get the proper idea, why well, you should head here to Lums, exit 456. Of Route 10 heading towards El Paso from San Antonio. And I'll, I'll give you a little picture of myself eating the rib. Yeah, this <laughs> That's is the, the entertainment. The, this is what you wanted to see. Now, here, here, here we go. <laughs> Bravo! <laughs> That's a rib. I just want to show you what it looks like. A big bite out of it. That's the bite. That's the size of my mouth. So, if you're in that, your police investigation unit, whatever it is, CIA, CID, 
from this you can deduce the size of the rib. Okay, so from the mouth to the rib, you're looking at about eight, eight nine inch of rib. Okay, maybe going on a ten. Okay. That's a big rib or a beef rib? Pork. Pork. Big rib. Big pork. Now our pork is ready. Which I know you're going to get those. Joan's going to make believe that she's mobile. Mobile. You see, I have my new hat on. It scares people. It really should. It's, it's, a, it's a nice hat, but it's a kind of toss between a preacher and a maniac, basically. Uh, and, uh, the long hair and a little skinny Ben Franklin glasses. It's, it's scary. Yeah, and there's, there's Joan now going to get the coffee. So we'll cut this short because we don't want to keep it longer than six or seven minutes. It's so cold outside, you know, we figured we didn't need a heater because we'd drive during the daytime. But it's been cold since we hit Tallahassee. It stayed cold and rainy with no sunshine. We had two days of sunshine. I think we're on our fifth day now. I don't even know what day it is anymore. So, let me see what... Anyway, I'm trying to figure out. I got some blockage here. But uh, the beans are very good here. Got beans and potato salad. The beans have a little of that chili in them, you know, it's a little better. And the potato salad is. That other potato salad. That creamy kind, you know. Put it against the black of my hat, or the black of my. See it? Okay. show you Joe getting the coffee. It's, it's a really interesting deal. There she is now. Now serve yourself here. They serve you the barbecue and then you get everything. Where is she? Oh, yeah, she's coming back so quickly. Oh, she is. Is that for me? Um, you want to get one for yourself? Get... Okay. Well, we just got some freshly brewed coffee because we're falling asleep. It's so goddamn cold. I got my coffee now. It's a big Texas sized coffee. As you can see, 96 ounces. It's enough to. You can basically feed an army on it. Give it to me and I'll pour it. Okay, I'm sorry. This is like a colada. This is like a Cuban colada where you can pour it into little cups, but. <laughs> it's pretty big. So, anyway, you have a chance if you're passing through here. To get your money's worth, I think this costs 12 or 13 bucks. This platter it feeds us two, and we have enough left over for two more meals. So, as we say on the trails, vaya con Dios, hasta luego, adios, and uh, and whatever else, thank you. whatever else. So what's your name? My name is Sheila. Sheila. Sheila, in about two nights you're going to be on YouTube because we yeah. take these travel videos wherever we go. Okay. And so you know what YouTube is? The Your kids will know what YouTube uh, is. My computer is out, but yeah, my kids do. Yeah, so. My daughter. Okay, so my if sister. I just go to YouTube and those are the two words you put in the search argument Soul Speak Spring and Junction, and you'll see you'll come right up. Okay. Okay, because we enjoyed your place. It was nice. We just wanted okay. to get a picture of the people, you know, so yeah. we know that live people served us. Oh, is that the owner? Is that Lum? Yeah. Hey, Lum, you, you make great barbecue. I think this is Lum. In fact, this is going to be on YouTube in a couple of nights. I gave your friend there. 
she all the addresses how to get to it, okay? So you'll be nationwide. You'll be worldwide. Oh, thank you. Mr. Thank you. Man does the cooking. <laughs> We're big barbecue fans, you know, from Florida, so we, we eat a lot of Q. This is a nice Q. It's a, it's a real healthy health one, too. Appreciate y'all stopping by. Yeah, it was, it was, it was a real treat. Now, this Joe's going to pay the bill now. She's going to clean up, right? <laughs> there she goes. That'll, that'll fix it up. Um, I have got to pay today also. Small one. It's the real money we're passing here, too. This and is a coffee. Oh. Okay, so. I think one more look at Lum back here because he's a healthy looking man. I get. <laughs> He's eating his own cue, I can tell. He's like me. <laughs> Eat the products. Too much, really. <laughs> it's worthwhile, let me tell you. Oh, thank you. Alright, thanks guys. Yeah, follow Joan around here. Get some more coffee for us, baby. And just tell the charges for two coffees. Yeah, or whatever it is. Okay. Okay. Are these sure?